night, folks. Good night, folks. Yay, good night. Stop my host. Ah. But then I heard later that he, that he passed away, so I felt really bad that I said it oh, because no. I didn't know. Hi everyone, welcome to a new Begijnhoeven video. My name is Rob. My name is Tommy. And in this video uh, I'm going to take you with me to Fijfhuizen. I'm going there for seeing my family after a long time and I'm going to train my students again. And... And... I had a phone call with Daniela because in the previous videos we named the foal Ocento, as you might have seen. Uh, and we said that it's nice because he's retired, but it turned out a little different. And it's a nice name, of course, and we didn't know everything. Um, and this week I'm going to uh, check some cameras. So um, yeah, we want to improve uh, with the camera work. So uh, yeah, we're going to test some new ones and see what's the best. Yeah, and guys, if you noticed, beside the subscribe button, there is a notification button. There is a bell. Yes, if you hit that bell, button, bell. you will see everything when we post new videos or you get a bell, comments, I guess you get a bell. Probably, yeah. Bell, bell. So don't forget <laughs> to subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification button. Enjoy the video. Good morning, guys. Um, yeah, today it's Friday, and after two and a half months, I finally can go back to my other stable in uh, Vijfhuis, close to Amsterdam. Um, yeah, due to Corona crisis, uh, I haven't been able to go there. Um, so I'm going to see some of my students again um, and I'm going to see my mom for the first time. Uh, yeah, it's about two hours drive, something like that. And I will stay over the night and then I will have some trainings on Saturday and then I go home. But first I'm going to get a coffee. My day of training is finished and now I'm going to my mom. <laughs> Hi mom. Hi Tom. <laughs> and look who is here. My Dushi. Uh, Hi sis. How are you? I'm fine. I'm finally seeing you after two and a half months. Can you be a little bit more excited? No. This is a vegan shawarma. Yes. And what is it made of? It's interesting. Oh, I have to check the uh, but I think it's soya. Oh, yeah. And my mom is cooking the normal dish. So guys, yeah, that was it for today. I love you. Hello. Good night, folks. Good night, folks. Yay, good night. Everyone. So today is an exciting day. Today uh, Remco, the photographer, and Jacqueline, the cameo, are going to test some new cameras. And we want to have better quality of camera. Uh, so we're going to test a few cameras today. Hi Jacqueline. Hi Remco. <laughs> <laughs> Echo. Go, go. Maar ik zie wel het verschil. Dus dat is heel vet, hè? Ja. Dat is echt mooi qua. Dat ziet iedereen. Zijn we klaar? Ik heb uh, pijn in mijn ja. hand. <laughs> nee, ik ga nog maar even door. <laughs> het is niet even voor de buis. Ik wil zelf gaan filmen, dan wordt het een beetje lastig. Hoe <laughs> ja. moet je dat doen? Oh, het kan wel. Ik laat het niet vallen. Ja, ik ben links. Dat ben je ergens. Ik sta op mijn hoofd. Ah! Serieus? Ja. Ja. Ik zie mezelf niet. Dan sta ik weer op mijn hoofd. Hey. Ik denk dat je het scherp verkeerd om of niet. Nee, hij draait dat het mee. Ja. Nee, dit is niks. Dat is niet goed. <laughs> nee, dan gaat het promotie beginnen. <laughs> <Ja. laughs> 
I'm a horse rookie. <laughs> we took a look at some cameras and Remco behind the camera and Jacqueline were testing those cameras and I think we found a very very good one. So I'm very excited actually because then we can make very very good footage. So uh, yeah, I hope that you guys feel the same in a few weeks when we have the camera. So stay tuned. So good morning guys. I need to say something because in one of the last videos uh, you could have seen that a foal has been born and we named him Uchento, which was a really cool name. And then I said that I know a horse from Daniela Famulo and his name was also Uchento and that she probably don't mind because he's retired. So I heard that he uh, passed away because of colic, so I felt really bad that I've said that. So I thought I'd just give her a call to see how she's doing. So good morning, Dan. Good morning. How are you? It's very early for me. Very early morning, why? Hmm? I have a baby, so uh, my evening and night is... Uh... Short. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you look still pretty as always. I'm not a very morning person, also. <laughs> but I hope my English is okay, because even my Dutch in the morning is not <laughs> I know, because uh, I was thinking to call you uh, because in our previous video there was a foal been born and um, I said in the video that we well, yeah, we would name him Uchento, which is nice and I said oh I know an Uchento, he was from Daniela and I used to train together with Daniela and Uchento so I think it's nice and I think Uchento is retired but then I heard later that he, that he passed away so I felt really bad that I said it oh, because no. I didn't know No, well I saw your video and uh yeah, I was so proud and yeah, I liked it very much that you called uh, Uchento and that you said, well, he's retired, doesn't matter anyway. Okay, oh, now that's good to hear because I felt really shit about it that I said no, it like no, that. No. Because like, oh no. No, it's okay. But uh, yeah, how are you doing? Because uh, yeah, it's a long time that we've spoken to each other and we know each other like forever. I'm, I think yeah, you were juniors and I was riding with the young riders then yeah. the first time I met you, I remember that. A lot have changed. Being a mother is very nice and uh, oh, wow. I'm, a, I'm a happy mom. And oh, with great. the horses is also uh, very much changed because uh, what you said, Chento has passed away and it was my, um, yeah, my horse that clears the way for everything and I ride uh, Europeans and championships and world yeah. championships so that was really my my buddy yeah we were one so uh, that was a was a slap in the face when he, when yeah. he uh, went away because okay, I awesome. didn't uh, get to say goodbye to him because I was on vacation with my boyfriend and he uh, he got a colic and he didn't even uh, go to the to the vet because he was so bad in short time so here here at home we have to let him go so the next day on vacation uh, my mom calls well I think you have to sit down so that was uh, was a little bit of a pity but now I have a super nice Grand Prix horse uh, Diano yeah I've seen him in uh, Geestere last year really yeah, nice yeah. And I think that is uh, really my future horse uh, for the Grand Prix. Yeah. But now I'm a rider uh, on the... On the floor. On the floor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I heard something that you broke your foot. Yeah. Uh, my lovely horse used me as a carpet. <laughs> and they say, well, four to six weeks recovering. But I, I think I'm going to ride next week. <laughs> tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, tomorrow. Yeah, but that's with us. Top sport people, eh? we, if the doctors say two weeks, we do it in one. If they say six, we do it in three. So yeah. that's good, yeah. Who's training your horses right now? Uh, my mom. And I have a very nice uh, girl since uh, a few months in the stable. And she uh, is riding lessons with me since she was 12 and she's now 18. So it's, well, we can let her do her thing. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, that's really, really nice. Yeah, really nice. I mean, when you have to sit down there with your leg up, being in pain and you can't even train your horse or you have to worry about it. It's no, I don't have to worry about yeah. anything, so that's good. You were also my trainer. Yeah, with ago. the Cento, yeah, remembering. Yes. But then he was, I think, how old was he back then? Five? 
or six. I think I was going from the juniors. No, young riders I was riding him then. When I was training you, I think he was younger because I, I thought we just did the flying changes or so. Wasn't it? It's so long yes, ago. So I, I don't know. Think, I don't yeah, remember because it was minutes. very uh, short time that I went with Cento from zero to young riders or yeah, yeah. or juniors or anything. So that was in your uh, in your yeah. time. In my time, <laughs> I'm oh, I'm getting old. I feel old when you say that. <laughs> okay, now so I'm very happy to see that you're doing well, and I hope to meet you soon again on competitions because it's been a while. Here's the deal: you come over. And then we're going to drink a nice glass of wine or two or three together. And then you can sleep over at the Begijnhoeven. That would be nice. Yeah, super nice. And oh, then I leave cool. the baby at home with Papa. Yeah. So Mama is a night out. Deal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, deal. <laughs> okay, really nice. So yeah, um, I wish you a very good day. And I hope to st uh, we see each other soon. Yeah, and I would really like to see some more pictures of Uchenna. Oh, we for sure will. We keep you yeah. posted. Say hi to your dear mom from me and see you soon. I will. And take care of yourself. Stay calm. Don't fall down anymore. No, no, no. <laughs> I promise. I promise. Okay, thank you. Okay. Bye. Bye bye. 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 Mm. So guys, thanks for watching this video. We have some special news because now we know a date. Approximately. Yeah, for moving the horses. Yeah. Only a few more weeks and then we can move to the new uh, construction site. There will, there will still be a construction site, but we can already work there. Um, there's going to be a very nice special this Sunday about the construction site. So I'm going to uh, show you some details about it and I'm going to tell you a bit uh, what we did the last few months. So thumbs up if you like this video. Yeah, and, and leave a comment, of course. See you next time. Bye-bye.